All right, so we have Carlock parts. I'm gonna let you figure out why I can't show all of one of those. And then the second one, uh, here we go. We still have that layer line, which means my exposure time is not long enough. So I'm gonna have to either move it up or I didn't update this file. Not sure which, but it doesn't really matter. It does matter because Emmett is still having some trouble. But that's that one. Let's have a look at what Sadako is doing as far as bases go. Oh, no. Actually, actually, I think we don't have it. Well, I mean, those aren't really square, but they're the bottom. So it's not really that big of an issue, honestly. I mean, unless the, uh, the person is cool with it because the TV is just going to sit on those pegs. Is that really a problem? Whoever ordered this, let me know. But uh, we have an arm that is perfect. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure that this uh, screen is kind of busted because it, it's doing some weird stuff. And I just replaced it like a couple weeks ago, but I must have done a bad job. So coming back over here, uh, so we have what looks like a very successful Carlock bottom bit with the scruff on top with the tail, and this is the axe, and the axe looks perfect. And there are some legs over here that are completely done uh, that I can't find right now. But they're fully wrapped. I did them for a different order, and they, oh, I couldn't ship them because they were the wrong things. Somebody else, they wanted the clothed version of the legs, so I had to reprint the legs, but there are wrapped legs somewhere in this room, and I'm gonna find them. Ah, here they are. Here are the burrito legs that are ready to go, but they're not... They're unused at the moment. So they're gonna go to this car lock with the dong and the massive ta ta mommy milkers and the legs and the axe and the tail. So that car lock is done. We just have to get the base working, which is the problem. Ha! I don't even know where. I don't even know what's happening here. Uh, yeah, I got. Now let's check on Emmett because I have been dealing with this for a couple days now, because of that sludge. I wasn't happy with this thing because. There was like a layer on the bottom. So I've had it soaking for an entire day. And I'm gonna go scrub it. And if it doesn't work, then I'm gonna have to set up the file again and redo it. All right, so it looks like scrubbing with a toothbrush fixed the problem. So I think it's ready for drying. This looks good. And here we have Emmett's son. I don't really know what this is about, but uh, remember and that we once lived. So it is quite interesting and it's like a box so you can open it up and stuff goes inside. I'm told it's a Final Fantasy something. But it is done look at the other part which is this man who is suffering I'm not entirely sure what he's suffering about but he is a suffering he's missing some feet and one foot has like elephant foot Titus and this one is flat on the bottom but it doesn't matter it is a complete box ready to go just have to cure the bottom part and I nope top parts cured and the people are cured so it is ready tomorrow I'm gonna try to show you Gish Lane but I also promised Peach Figures that I'd clean up this area a little bit so most of the day is gonna be cleaning and then putting uh, Madam Titty Kitty on display so I did some looking and all we have left to do is just Sadako that is it. That is the last of our prints. So we are going to use all of our printers right now to finish her up. Also, uh, Raven with her massive dong. Uh, this cape is solid and it's too heavy. 
is too heavy, and it's the only reason I'm not shipping her. So we gotta get her sorted out, and then she is gone also. So we're gonna print her last part on this janky lefty printer. Lefty's gonna take care of that. And then everything else is gonna be Sadako, and we are gonna be done. Also, you're probably not curious, but every single printer has its own special USB drive, so I know which one goes to which printer. That's how I can tell the difference. So we're gonna start all that now, and we're gonna patch up that tomorrow. So I will talk to you all later. Bye!